Welcome back, guys and gals. If you're just joining us, we met this... I don't even know if he's considered a hobo or a weirdo, but he calls himself the rat, and he's made this whole small town here in the sewers where you have shit and diarrhea waterfalls all over his town. I guess that's the way he likes it, but um, <clears throat> we have to go find his son because his son should have been back by now and uh, hopefully give us some clues on finding where our own family is. It sucks when you have to do favors for somebody else before you can move along with your own game because it's just like, in the real world, it's like, you know what? No, I'm not going to do anything for you. I'm here to find who I need to find, you know? It's like, I don't know how you can find the, um, the willpower to just put that on pause to help one other person. How long has it been since you looked outside, Mr. Wayne, <clears throat> to make order out of chaos? Uh, it's not that long, really. Actually, probably a couple minutes. Well, I must tell you, if that's what they do, chaos is winning by a mile. Probably. What'd that do? Oh, okay, I see that over there. Let's see if we can, uh, make this jump. Oh! Shit! <laughs> Sorry. I don't know why I thought I was just going for a pitfall there. It's probably because I'm too used to that shit right now. Anyways, let's keep going. There we go. If you notice, I did wait just a little bit until I was off the ledge to get like an extra uh, pixel of a jump. Probably a couple bit, and I totally missed that jump. Awesome. <laughs> Sorry about that. Let's 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 do it right this time. I wonder if you can actually hit him off of that, perhaps. Probably not. Let me just... Because he's glowing blue. Okay, well, he's not doing it, so let's go ahead and just keep going. <coughs> I do see something back there. Uh, what is this? Denang 68. Man, this is just weird. Just finding all sorts of pictures from unknown soldiers, people. Up. All right. Cool. Down here, life will begin. Below the circles of hell. Below the moving plague of death. Within the labyrinth, paradise will be reborn. Damn, this guy really is just. But that will be the future, Mr. Wayne. This guy is just crazy. At least the old man knew how to build himself a place where he would be safe. That's true. Shit! No! No! Ah. Uh, well, is there a way to actually... Hmm. Well, I guess this is where problem solving comes in handy. Let's go ahead and try to figure this out. Awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this here and see if this will allow us to... Point. <coughs> Guessing I'll have to put the box near the ledge and then uh, jump off the box to get to that upper portion, perhaps. Let's give it a try. Definitely don't. Oh, what the fuck! God damn it! All right, let's give this another try. So I'm gonna see if I can push this here. Now, this is just my theory. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna look extremely stupid doing it. Ah. Uh, oh. Thank you. It worked. Okay, so I, I'm guessing this puts down either all the bridges or just one. And we can go ahead and just keep on pulling this box. <clears throat> Let's see. Just over here. I think this will be fine. Oops. We get a... There we go. This will, uh... Okay, well, I don't want to... Okay, just drop down. There we go. Let's break through that wall. Okay. And we can take out this as well. <coughs> I'm guessing I have to put this box right over this little bridge. And then switch the lever so that way the bridge will go immediately um, down. I don't know how some old homeless guy was able to build this uh, 
this place full of. If you need my help. You just need to call me, Mr. Wayne. Full of traps. I will help you stay on the path through my personal hell. Uh, I just don't know how he how he could do this all by himself. To be honest, I mean he's old and weak, and he's basically built a town. There it is. Uh, Nine circles of hell from Dante's Divine Comedy. Um, from that, it's it's just like a novel or whatever. Um, I, I like to consider it a comic book, really. Oh shit! Sorry about that. Oh, damn it! Hey, actually, wait. That's not so bad. I could actually use that. But let's see if I can jump through here. I don't think I can reach it. No, I can't. All right. Well, anyways, um, as I was saying, um, the Divine Comedy is actually this book talks about this person named Dante um, he follows the uh, I'm not exactly sure what it was about but um, he follows this person named Virgil and he Virgil kind of guides him through hell uh, purgatory and heaven and whatever and just teaches him everything about the nine circles and whatever which uh, new game Dante well not really new but the game Dante's Inferno came out based on that but some things were a little uh, tossed up left and right <clears throat> All right, so we finally reached this place. Not sure if the cutscenes are gonna mute itself. Oh, guess we're good. Here it is. Take a look at the photograph. It won't be difficult to recognize the son of the rat, but be careful with the other men. The living are just as dangerous as the dead. No, the living are actually much more dangerous than the dead. Do you need help, Mr. Wayne? Uh, I don't know. You were been glowing blue, so I assumed that I could. Anyways, I do not want to drop in this poopy diarrhea lake here. Oh man, it's so gross. Oh boy, okay. What is this? Hell is for people? These drawings are different from the previous ones. <clears throat> they describe the bombings that affected the city at the beginning of the epidemic. Bombings? I'm guessing maybe it's kind of like a... Uh, very similar to like Resident Evil, maybe like kind of like a virus outbreak via missile. That's true, man. They should have picked another way to. Oh crap! There's actually a zombie right there. Okay, well, I gotta figure out how the hell I get up here. Oh, that's right. I can go ahead and use uh that. I could just jump clear over that zombie and. Make my way. Okay, so these are traps. I'm just gonna jump. Oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> god. I feel like every time I, I die from one of these traps, I feel so stupid. Alright, let's just run through everything. These traps Perfect. look like they've been designed to protect against the dead. And the living. And the living, yeah. I mean, the only traps I would think to protect, uh, protect myself from the dead is just... When the epidemic spread to Seattle, the people made a stand, tried to fight. Many died, and then returned to consume the few that didn't. Then the military tried to fight back at the shadows. Look around, what and the... see how that ended. God. <laughs> Speaking of things ending... Oh my god. I totally forgot what I was going to say, too. When the epidemic spread to Seattle, the people made a stand, tried to fight. Many died, and then returned to consume the few that didn't. There we go. Then the military tried to fight back in the shadows. <clears throat> Look around, and see how that ended. Man, these puzzles are so elaborate, so thought through. I'm gonna wait. I'm not going to go down right away, because I see there's some other things up here that you can probably get to. Oh, of course I'm not just going to fall like that to my death. Make this right. Perfect. Alright, open that. Something's blocking the machinery. Hmm. I'm not sure what could be blocking it. Now, I'm not even sure... I can move Okay, I can go on top of that. Right? Okay, good. Now, what the hell could be blocking this thing? 
And what about these soldiers? The new law? I told you. When times change, men must change. We all make choices, Mr. Wayne. In chaos, some choose to show the best sides of themselves. Others, the worst. Ah, okay. So you this... must hurry. I worry for the safety of my sons. And the ones you care for, too. It actually controls that. Perfect. Now, I see that you can easily go up there, but there was a room at the very bottom, so I'm going to check that out first. Alright, here we're at the room that we totally skipped out on. We're going to go check through it. I think we had to just run right through it. Just like that. Whoa. Whoa. Calm down. What do we have here? Any useful items you can use? <sighs> just some more IDs. So let's go ahead and return back to where we were. Oh, just like a very... I'm glad that thing didn't break off. And then we just kind of have to go back the same way we came by triggering these traps, but we're going to go ahead and just uh, continue. Alright, so let's... I'm. This is another one of the same traps, so getting through it, you just have to easily run through, pass them all. And of course, if you do see another one go for your head, it's just always press the, the left trigger to roll. It's always going to come in handy. Alright. Again, don't touch the duty water. See another area over there that you can break through. Are we gonna deal with any more zombies? And is this timed? God, I hope not. I guess you have to break, uh, yep. Find another box here. And then raise the water level to bring that box up. So some of these, well, most of these puzzles are just extremely, you know, basic. Oh shit, I probably shouldn't have done that. Well, I'm sure I could just run and jump across through everything. I guess not. Alright, I pulled it a little bit closer. We're gonna give this another try. Oh, what the fuck? Alright, gonna get it this time. Just a regular jump. There we go. Oh, finally. It always seems like, like it's, you're just gonna miss the ledge, but then he just, like, barely, like, decides to go for it again. Alright, we'll have to run and jump across this one. Some more mementos, perhaps? Innocent people who tried to look for a safe place during the Great War against the Shadows. Great War. They were crushed to death by a landslide caused by bombing. That ain't good. Oh. There we go. I'm not sure if we can nail that jump, so we'll have to go here instead. Perfect. Oh man, this thing's leaning down. Okay, cool. This game uh, also reminds me of Nosferatu. Just because of the... Um, oh, trick shots. Trick shots, of course. Let's see if we can do this. Yeah! Let's go ahead and go over here. Yeah, it does remind me of Nosferatu a little bit. Just because of the uh, 3D aspect of the side-scroller. Um, with the ledges and jumping across things. Prince of Persia and Nosferatu. He's blocking the machinery. Alright, let's get rid of that. Nothing's blocking it now. Oh shit. I can't go on. Follow this path going up. Up to the old subway station. When you get to the outside, look for the house that grows in the tree. Alright, well... Find my son before those men do. And I'll help you find the ones you care for. Alright, so it seems like th we're going to be heading to the very last parts of this puzzle. So, um, we'll cut it here and then the next one we should be out for good. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next part of Deadlight and hopefully find the son of this rat. Uh, I don't even know what to think of this kid. But anyways, can't be any gr um, more gruesome than what his dad looks like. But thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.